Among all the military hardware we've seen in Ukraine is one particularly interesting weapon. This footage has appeared widely on social media and is said to show a Ukrainian soldier firing a long-range anti-materiel rifle known as the Alligator. Now these AMRs, as they're called, are produced in Ukraine and fire a high-caliber 14.5mm cartridge. They're designed to take out equipment rather than people and a bullet from this will pierce a centimeter of armor plating from two kilometers away. But the 14.5 cartridge is extremely powerful, it makes most 12 sevens or 50 kills that people know commonly look like pea shooters. 14.5 fires a 60 to 65 gram projectile compared to the Browning, which is about 42 grams and it shoots it at almost a thousand meters per second. In other words, to shoot any kind of uh, vehicles, rocket launchers, radar installations, aircraft parked, helicopters. So they're not really intended or dedicated as an anti-personnel weapon. The Alligator carries a five round magazine. It's two meters long and weighs in at a hefty 25 kilos. Now to try and counteract the massive recoil of this, the rifle's fitted with a big muzzle brake at the front of the barrel, an isolator system to dampen the kickback and a padded stock. The Alligator also has a little brother, the T-Rex. It's the same caliber and looks very similar, but only fires one shot at a time. The reason why they're gaining some popularity is that the more expensive dedicated anti-armor weapons like the N-Laws and the Javelins are, are really uh, not things to be wasted on targets that they were not intended for. So as the war drags on, I would think that they would like to keep those in reserve for what they were meant for. And that opens up the use of something like an anti-material rifle for other purposes, locking out ordinary vehicles and targets at longer range. The penetration is around 30 millimeters of armor at 100 meters, which is really quite impressive. The big issue I think with the 14.5 is the muzzle blast is absolutely unimaginably huge. It's like a, a hand grenade going off at the muzzle of the gun. The Ukrainian military adopted the Alligator in 2021 before the Russian invasion. It's not known how many of these they have, but even one used effectively can be pretty devastating on the battlefield. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.